Hi everyone! I hope you're all well. I hope you're having a great week, enjoying the sunshine. We're going to read a little bit about Moon Soup today. This is one of my favorite books. Alright, ready? I've got the house to myself and I'm making Moon Soup. It all begins at sunrise when the rooster cock a doodle doos and the hens lay their eggs. Six eggs are what I'll need, no more, no less. I toss them into the biggest pot I can find. If not, an umbrella will do. There is no milk in moon soup. Purple is the main ingredient. I gather lilacs and violets at noon, grapes and eggplants, even an emperor's robe. I mix and blend well. I need teacups galore. I have a party and I'll invite all my friends. We drink tea with pie and eat cookies shaped like stars. Everyone sings and laughs and talks and they drop their cups into the soup on their way out the door. I stir once or twice. As the clock strikes six, I grab a giant net and scoop a peachy sunset. Then I turn on some music and dance, letting the soup simmer until the moon is high in the sky. When I'm through gathering and adding, I've mixed, blended, tossed, scooped, and stirred, I put my wings in place. I fly through the window and zoom past the stars, because moon soup can't be eaten in the kitchen or in the yard, or in the meadow, or in my room. Moon soup must be eaten on the moon. Thank you, everyone. I hope you're having a wonderful week. We'll see you real soon.